Hi. In this video, I'll try to explain how our Odoo Salesforce connector works. Uh, once you have installed the application, the Salesforce connector will appear on the main screen, um, home screen. So uh, right now, what we'll do is we'll try to unselect all the options and you know go one by one uh, regarding uh, the steps that are involved from that is from configuration to till the import and export of products. So first we need to go to the settings page and click on Salesforce and then enter the Salesforce credentials. Uh, once we have entered the correct credentials, what will happen is we can click on test credentials to know whether uh, the whether the connection whether the connection was successful or not or whether the credentials were valid or not. So uh, credentials were, you know, successful. Connection was established successfully. So I'll go back to the home screen and go click on Salesforce Connector. Now, first thing is that I'll try to import the customers or contacts from, you know, uh, Salesforce. Uh, I can apply a, diff a custom date range uh, if I want to. If I don't apply a custom date range, it will fetch all of the customers. But if I want to fetch the, you know, uh, like uh, uh, in a given date range, I want to, you know, import data from a specific date range. I can also do that by applying the date fridge filter. Now, uh, the, you know, uh, the execution has been completed. Now, if I go to my contacts, I'll be able to see all of the contacts uh, and the customers also that were imported from Salesforce. So the next step is we can try importing the sales order contracts and quotes um, I'll select a couple of more so if I click on execute uh, now what will happen is the process will run start running and once the process is completed uh, I can see the log files over here which will show me how many records were actually you know imported uh, just to be sure so I'll go and check on the sales in the sales module, I'll see the number of you know quotations, and I can see the data that has been you know imported from uh, Salesforce. Uh, contracts come in the contracts contracts area. Uh, products come in the products area. If I click on a product, I can see all of the data related to that specific product. So now I'll try to go to the CRM to check the leads. So over here I can see all of the data, all of the leads that were imported from Salesforce, uh, along with their status. <laughs> now I'll go back to the settings, and in case I want to instantly sync uh, the data from Odoo to uh, you know Salesforce, I need to click these options. These options over here will instantly sync the data from Odoo to Office 365. Like for example, if you make an instant change in the lead or anything uh, that you have selected, so it will update that status uh, back in the Salesforce. Now, for example, if I create a lead over here in Odoo, or you can say an opportunity, Now I click on add and the lead has been added. I'll add the expecting close date, closing date. Also, you know, mention the type, change the st stage of the lead and click on save. Now if I go to Salesforce and refresh my opportunities, this is the lead, you know, so we didn't have to, you know, uh, click on export functionality. So if we check that option, it will instantly sync the data back in the Salesforce or if you update the data, it will also do that.
So yeah, that's pretty much it from you know our side.